Hi, my name is Anne Hathaway, and I'm getting bookish with Scary Mommy. When I entered first grade, everyone else had learned how to read in kindergarten, but I wasn't a part of that kindergarten class, so I didn't actually know how to read. And my teachers thought I did, and my parents thought I was learning. So anyway, there was there was a pretty long stretch in first first grade where I was supposed to know how to read and didn't know. So then I wound up getting a tutor. Um, and she helped catch me up. And I remember the first book that I ever read by myself was The Velveteen Rabbit. So I have to say The Velveteen Rabbit does hold a special place in my heart. All of the mystery books that I read for my childhood, um, you know, the Encyclopedia Browns, uh, the Nancy Drews. I loved uh, A Wrinkle in Time, Madeline Langle's uh, book. She's so brazen. You know, like she's just so, so, so brazen and megalomaniacal. And um, and I think that that's part of the joy of her, uh, in terms of being able to watch her. Like when she exists in real life, we um, well, hopefully we try to vote them out of office. But um, but when you know, just somebody who's that power hungry and someone who's who's that much of a bully, but is so kind of like quest I don't know, strangely sensitive at the same time. Um, it's a it's a pretty intoxicating combination when it comes to entertainment. I think uh, Dahl did an amazing job in creating an environment where uh, our imaginations were scarier. Uh, and, and, you know, because he painted these very vivid uh, uh, creatures. And um, I think that's, our imaginations ran wild when we read Dahl. And because he, you know, his writing was evocative of, of, of it in that way. And so I think that's why um, his characters resonate in the way that they do and why people love uh, this book as much as they do. I would never pick up a book because it, it made me cry. I feel like there's so much going on in the world that makes me cry that I would want to escape to uh, some place uh, magical, whimsical, um, uh, something that is a far cry from what we're experiencing in real life has to be hard copy. I can't. Somebody pointed out to me though the, the way to do it if you're not an e-reader because I find that, you know, the problem is right now obviously in these troubled times it's not a problem. It's just a it's just a condition. Um, is that you can't really go to bookstores and browse the way you used to, um, partially because there aren't enough bookstores anymore. And so I order these books that look interesting and they arrive and they're not for me. So somebody pointed out that you can test them out on an e-reader and then if they if you respond to them then you can order them for real. So that's the way I'll probably use it. Guys, you should watch Witches on HBO Max. It's streaming now.